first in the main display, there's several menu choices on the side of the display. First, display settings where you can pick language and your units, metric or English. And this is where you would set reference lines on the displays to show either the rotor chamber edge or tire edge. This is helpful for the operator when guiding the machine either on a trailer or during work. In this screen where you find machine settings, this is where the operator can configure several of the controls to suit how they like to operate the machine. An example is leg height controls. The operator can choose how the legs respond when they move toggle switches. Others here are steering controls and rotor lowering. You can choose the speed at which the rotor will plunge into the cut. All of these are configurable for the operator and if you're using operator profiles will be saved with that operator's pin number. In the total screen, this is a screen that just shows how much work the machine has done. In the engine screen, you can see fuel usage and then there's screens here for both spray systems, water and emulsion, two for each one, where maybe you want to measure how much water you deliver per truck or and save one for how much water you've delivered for an entire day of work. And in each screen, you have the opportunity to zero all of the totals and start over. The fourth screen is our diagnostics or service screen where you can see faults in the machine if you're having any faults. And this is where either a technician will use these screens or the operator can use these when doing some remote troubleshooting with a technician at the dealer. This is also where you'll find tow mode. If the machine does happen to fail and you need to get it off of the job, you can release the parking brake and put it in tow mode so it can be towed off of the job. The last screen is for the operator where you can set application profiles. If you have a job that you're doing regularly, you can save all the parameters of the water spray systems, the emulsion spray system, how deep you're working, door positions, those can be saved so when you come back to that job you can select that profile and there's no need to reset all of those features. Also in this display you see the standard meters for engine temperature, hydraulic oil temperature, a fuel gauge, you can see the position of the wheels for steering position, how fast the engine is running, how fast the machine is running in feet per minute or meters per minute, and then total hours on the machine.